The CMS Beginning Teacher Development and Support Department has created the Beginning Teacher Competencies. These are specific competencies that we as a district focus on growing within our beginning teachers. This initiative developed from our work with the University of Charlotte to provide student teachers with an experience that prepares them for success as teachers in CMS. As we work to develop these competencies, we wanted to create alignment between the CMS strategic plan, the CMS core actions, the North Carolina teacher evaluation standards, and the NTAS standards used as part of the teacher education preparation program. Through many discussions with various stakeholders and universities, the four CMS BT competencies were identified. Beginning teachers enter the field of education well prepared by a variety of educational programming providers. In observing, coaching, and professionally developing the district's beginning teachers over the course of our team's existence, we have identified the four most critical competencies for a beginning teacher and CMS to have to ensure quality instructional practices for all students. Those are student engagement, analytical thinking, professional management, and reflective practices. Over the course of the next slides, we will further highlight each competency and provide the alignment to the documents by which we measure our success as educators. Continued growth in each of these competencies has aided in retaining our district's beginning teachers. We encourage you to jot down notes while we discuss each piece of this puzzle and provide us with feedback and any questions you may have. Let's get started. Quality instructional practices for all students is at the center of our competencies for beginning teachers. We are committed to acknowledging that students' needs are different and we need to meet the needs of all students. To do this, CMS is dedicated to employing instructional practices that allow all of our students to learn the content and skills that will help them succeed. This often starts with quality lesson plans, which have been internalized by the teacher. The CMS strategic plan prioritizes personalizing learning and teaching students in ways that reflect their cultures, identities, and experiences. Students learn in different ways and they succeed when we build on their strengths. Students also learn best when we meet them where they are in life through the work we do and the content we provide. In the bottom left corner of this slide and the following four slides, you will see how this focus aligns to the CMS core actions, strategic plan, teacher evaluation tool, and the student teacher and test standards. Student engagement is essential to learning. Beginning teachers should focus on three key areas of student engagement to provide quality instruction to all students. The key areas are behavioral, cognitive, and emotional. Behavioral engagement is the dimension referenced when focused on two key areas, students' level of participation and the submission of assignments. Cognitive engagement is a dimension referring to students being engaged with learning. Key areas are planning, monitoring their own progress, goal setting, and problem solving. And then emotional engagement is the affective dimension of learning. Key areas are interest and relationships that contribute to a student's ability to learn. Learners need a sense of belonging to feel engaged in discussions. They need to be able to ask and pose questions, seek help, and be curious about the topic. We want our beginning teachers to provide a balance of the types of student engagement to ensure that our learners continue growing. CMS values beginning teacher competencies surrounding developing the analytical thinking skills of students. The CMS strategic plan emphasizes challenging students with high level tasks and work. The plan explains that high expectations boost student achievement regardless of student background. These high expectations come from the teacher's belief about their students and their limitless potential 
because we know that low expectations from teachers can have a substantial negative impact on students' learning and progress. CMS beginning teachers employ high-level questions and tasks which address the analytical thinking skills required by the grade level standards. CMS is also dedicated to our teachers developing their professional management competencies. Teachers are encouraged in the CMS strategic plan to build on their strengths, adopt new ways of working, and to regularly measure, measure their progress. Professional management includes elements that beginning teachers sometimes struggle with, such as organizing their time, proactively managing their classroom, and prioritizing their own self-care. The first three years of teaching can be especially stressful as beginning teachers face challenges of adapting to a new career. It is important that we prepare our teachers for this time as well as teach them healthy ways to manage their stress and emotions. The final beginning teacher competency is reflective practices. Reflective teaching has benefits for teachers and students alike. Teachers can use reflective teaching techniques to improve their methodologies. Reflective practices can consist of reflecting on instruction, conducting self-assessments, considering improvements, problem solving, and developing analytical skills. Ongoing professional growth is necessary in the field of education. This includes the cultivation of emotional resilience and a good amount of grit in our ever-changing field. So this wraps up our presentation on the CMS beginning teacher competencies. But as an extension of these four competencies, our department has created the beginning teacher development and support on-demand PD library. The first tab contains a table of contents, as well as all the ways you can follow us on social media. The next four tabs are PD aligned to each of the four BT competencies. And those four tabs are PD directly for our beginning teachers only. And then the last tab is PD either specifically designed for mentors or mentor contacts and those are the people within our buildings who lead our beginning teacher program. There is also in this tab PD templates that can be copied and used as monthly PDs in your schools for beginning teachers and our mentors. The bit.ly to this resource is on the right and keep in mind it is case sensitive. We encourage you to take advantage of these amazing resources and also share any resources with us that you have and that we might be able to add to this library. As always, thank you for your time and the work you do to support beginning teachers and mentors.